Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be demoing and reviewing a foundation that I recently picked up from Sephora. The foundation is this Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Water Foundation and guys, it is the best foundation I have ever tried. You guys probably know the struggle of trying to find a foundation that matches you and that looks good on your skin, doesn't look cakey, doesn't dry up your skin or anything like that. This is the foundation that keeps it from doing all of those things. You will not believe how good this foundation is. I actually wore this foundation for the first time on Thanksgiving. I did my makeup around two o'clock and I put it on and everything. I looked in the mirror and it was, uh, I think it was like seven o'clock or something like that. And it looked just as flawless as when I put it on at two o'clock. I could not believe it. I'm like, this is gonna be a disaster. It's gonna be everywhere. But seriously, this is so, so good. I am not wearing any makeup right now so that I can show you guys how it applies, how it looks, and give you some kind of insight on how it feels and everything like that. This is the packaging. It's such just a cute little box. I don't know, it's, you know, if you care about packaging, it's a nice package. I got Fair Neutral. I don't know why I'm showing it to you guys, can't see it. <laughs> I got Fair Neutral, so there's two Fair shades. There's Fair Neutral and I think uh, fair, just regular fair, or something like that. I went to Sephora and I got color matched and they said fair neutral was best because, believe it or not, I have yellow in my skin also, as well as pink, which is crazy. I am very light skinned, as you can see, but I do have a little bit of yellow. Having a foundation that is yellow and pink based like this is perfect. I haven't been able to find any foundations that are like this because it doesn't have both undertones in one bottle. So opening it up, this is how it looks. It's got a little dropper and the foundation is very liquidy. Like it says, it's a water foundation. This little thing is like a little button and you actually push it down and it clicks. I'll show you guys when I do the demo, but it clicks and you see the foundation come out of the dropper. A little goes a long way. Like it, it is such a good coverage. It doesn't say on the box if it's full coverage or not, but I, I would say it's medium buildable. So you could make it full coverage, I think. It's a very, very amazing buildable foundation because a lot of foundations you use you put more on and try to build it and it just gets super cakey but this is just like liquid skin it's so cool I'm gonna show you guys a demo on my face so you guys can see exactly how it works alright so this is my face close-up you can pretty much see everything. I do have some redness down here and that's just always been there. I really don't understand why. First I'm going to prime my skin with the Maybelline Baby Skin because I have a lot of pores. I press it in because I found that pressing it in works the best. Then you can put the rest on the rest of the face. <laughs> Anytime I touch my face it immediately gets red but that's just how it is. So I have my beauty blender and it is damp. So I'm going to take the foundation and I'm going to put a few drops on it. So watch now. This might be enough. I mean, it's not a ton or anything. Just start dotting it on. So immediately when you put it on, it gives a pretty nice coverage. It feels so nice on the skin, like it's just like water, like it really is. It says it's water foundation and I feel like that's really what it is. I'm just going to add a little bit more. You just, you just have to kind of gauge 
how much you think you would need. I forgot to mention it's a super nice glass bottle, but I'm really super terrified of dropping it and breaking it. <laughs> I really am. Alright, so I'm just building it up now, especially on this area. So as you saw before, it was pretty red and it is definitely neutralizing that redness I had down there which has like never happened with the foundation like ever. So I'm trying to put it over the rest of my face. Just have to keep adding like the dropper does not dispense a ton but as you saw like a little bit went a long way for just like a light layer at the beginning if you just want the nice coverage. And I do have a pimple right here and it actually does a pretty nice job of covering it up. It was pretty red and so this kind of neutralizes the redness also. I'm starting to get a pimple right here which is really annoying but you know lady times do that. That's how a light layer of it looks. It's not like super full coverage so you could probably build it up to be full coverage and I actually do build it up more especially on this side and just keep building up that area. But as you can see, building it up didn't make it cakey, just goes right into your skin, just melts. Like it literally melts into your skin and feels like skin. Like it didn't feel oily, it didn't like really break apart, it really lasts a long time. I didn't really know if high-end foundations were worth it, but I, this one is really, really great. All right, I'm back and I just put on the rest of my makeup. Yeah, I just kind of threw it together, you know. This is the same look that I wore for Thanksgiving. If you guys want a tutorial, just let me know. The foundation looks exactly the same. The rest of my face makeup went on really nice. So just smooth and airbrushed. I just think this foundation is the best. It was $39 from Sephora and you get one fluid ounce. It's a pretty big bottle. I don't know. I think it's pretty much the same as all the other foundations, but you are paying a little bit extra, but I understand why now. So far, this is my favorite foundation, my go-to foundation now. So, so nice. I can barely feel it on my skin. Like, I feel like my skin is skin if that makes any sense like you can breathe and I have full face of makeup on and I just feel like my face is totally bare it's crazy this is how it looks it's so so nice I'll do a little zoom in zoom in for you guys to see okay so you're zoomed into my face pretty well so this is how the foundation looks just great it looks really great one problem I do have, but I always have with every foundation because my lines up here, my expression lines just don't go away. I'll probably have to get Botox one day, but I don't like needles. It's really, really nice. Like this is how the finish is. A nice satin finish foundation. So it's not matte, but it really does not budge throughout the day. It stays super well. Oh, and I forgot I should probably spray with some setting spray. I'm gonna do a quick spritz of the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Setting Spray. And that's pretty much it. I just sprayed that on there and it's going to last freaking all day. All day. Such a beautiful foundation. I think it's definitely worth trying out. If you're as fair as me and it's hard to find a foundation, this is a really great shade. Like it, it really does look like my skin. Not orange like an Oompa Loompa or anything like that. Super, super nice, perfect shade match. This foundation is definitely worth every penny. I hope this review slash demo helps you out. If you like reviews and demos, give this video a big thumbs up. That always helps me out and I will know to do more of these things. If you are not subscribed yet to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Hit it, hit it, please. There will also be a chance to subscribe at the end of the video if you really think you need time, but I think you'll really like my channel. If you're interested in my social media, 
it is linked down below in the description. Go check those out because I put lots of fun stuff on like my Snapchat and Instagram. Also a link to the previous video that I did will be the end of this video and yes, that's a lot of videos. <laughs> I say that in every video but it's fun to say, okay? fun. Go check out that video and give it a big thumbs up as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!